I knew I had a good feeling about you. <laughs> Cheers, Rumi. I think I slept with your boyfriend. Mm. <laughs> <laughs> what? Oh, well, those pictures on the fridge, that's your boyfriend? Yes, that's, um, that's definitely my boyfriend. I slept with a guy who looks a lot like him. Mm. It could have been him. It might not have been, but... Okay. I mean, I'm more judgmental. We've only been together for like six months, right? Oh, it was two weeks ago. Oh, skank. What? Sorry. I mean, you didn't know. I mean, how would you know? You didn't know, did you? I didn't. I was just at karaoke. We sang a, um, a duet by Elton John. Me and... Uh... Tom. I would have said Ted, but that's close. Tom, put that one on my phone. Well, I definitely slept with your boyfriend. <laughs> oh, you're my lawyer too. We can be real with each other. I know that you know. Know what? Two years ain't nothing next to life. JD took that plea to get convicted as the perfect alibi. Alibi for what? When he was meant to be robbing that bottle shop, he was three blocks away at the tats jamming a knife in a Vinnie Walker. No way. No way? I seen it happen. He gave me the knife after. See? See, I'm the one he really loves. Yeah two days out of the week and I'm your dream girl. But you have me for all seven and you'll start missing the woman who got your kids off to school and had dinner on the table by six. How could you possibly know that? I deserve something real and this, this isn't real. We've got a good thing going here. It might be good for you. But it is not good for me. Not anymore.